Introducing first the fighter to my left, fighting out of the blue corner. He represents D-Town, B-Town, and Oriental Arts. From Davenport, Iowa, he stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 167 and a half pounds, Chris Ruthless Rungi Rungi! And his opponent fighting out of the red corner. He stands five feet, nine inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. From Amelia, Ohio, representing TG Force, Roger Bowling! Your referee for this fight is Mr. Kevin Kelly. Okay, Rob, here we go with a big fight coming up. A lot of people's ready to see this. Roger Bowling making his pro debut at 4-1. Chris Rung, Davenport, Iowa, 9-3. Roger Bowling's an extremely explosive local fighter. Very strong, very talented. Fights out of Team G-Force, and I don't, wouldn't you agree, Rob, to say he's a very well-rounded fighter? Very well-rounded fighter. Highly explosive. Oh, nice high kick, and there's his strength. Ooh. There's his strength, driving that shoulder down into him with a slam. He's got him up against the fence, trying to pound him. A yeah, very fast-paced fight. Looks like Rogers in uh, side mount a little bit, trying to pass to get in a full mount. I think he's just wanting to pound, Rob. Watch out for those up kicks. Absolutely, he's, he's got to be careful that. As we saw with the Dan Mundy fight, it just takes one little mistake to lose a fight that you're in control of. Now, Rob, when you're when you're when you're coaching and in the corner of people like Rich and big fights, Rich Franklin, UFC, what can a corner man like yourself say in this kind of situation? Well, you know what? It depends on the on the fighter. Some guys really are capable of listening and hearing you and making the adjustments. Some guys aren't. Uh, it really varies from fighter to fighter. Yeah, obviously, you want to try to tell them things that are gonna that are help better their position, whether it be on the ground or or stand up. Well, we're in a bit of a north-south position here. Rogers on top. Uh, you know, you'd like to think that he's going to try to pass and get around. You got him. He's sitting on the face here, and, and we could see uh, a possible knee bar or ankle lock out of this. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, full mount. This could be bad, Rob. Rogers so strong. Very hard to defend yourself against him in this position. A great wrestler and just got a great base and. You can see what's key is he's staying busy, right, Rob? Absolutely. That will wear your opponent out yeah, if you just he, stay he busy. Is. He's out cold. Yeah, he's His out, opponent's out cold. Nice finish. Nice finish. Very good win for Roger Bowling. Good show of sportsmanship there. I mean, Absolutely. Roger I was really did a good job of getting on top. And not freaking out, which you see a lot of young fighters do. They'll get on top, and when they get positioned, they don't take the time to get settled in. They overreact. He, he, picked, he picked the shots very, very well. Very well. Very, very impressive pro debut, I got to say. Absolutely. Roger Bowling also, I talked to him the other night, and he's just recently dropped to 170 pounds, which I think is a much better weight for him. Yeah, I think I agree with you on that. He's a big 170 pounder. 